you know, Mondays are about things to be happy about. And I was just reading the back and it says how it's been revised with over 4,000 new entries. That's 18,000 things to be happy about. I just, so let's see what, what, you know, what's who we got. Thank you for not smoking signs. That's funny. That's funny because it makes me think of my childhood and growing up in the 90s and to early 2000s. And this is not a thing anymore, but there was smoking and non-smoking sections of restaurants. And my mom being a s smoker when I was younger, uh, it was always a non. Yes? Are you okay? It was always, no, we didn't sit in uh, the smoking section because my mom was always a very conscious smoker in the sense of, if you know, she chose to engage in that, but she didn't want you around her when she was doing it in a way. So she would walk away from people or things like that. And she never wanted, yes, little girl. I'm telling a story here. Would you like to, would you like to tell your opinion? You have something to say? Okay. You have something to say? Okay. Anyway, for a second time, there would, I, I feel, I swear I recall that there would be signs in the restaurants or in the non-smoking sides that said, thank you for not smoking or, or things like that. But in general, you are definitely going to see thank you for not smoking signs uh, in healthcare facilities specifically and probably any area around uh, elevators for sure. She's got a lot to say. That's it. I don't have more to say about that. Thank you for not smoking. Uh, because only you can prevent forest fires, just like Smokey the Bear says. <laughs> so with that, I leave you with this gratitude to you for spending your time with me today. I'm very thankful you chose to do so. And I would really love for you to stick around. Hit that subscribe button, hit that like button so we can nourish the algorithm. And remember that happiness is your birthright. You are entitled to it, so stop standing in your own way.